Also, as my good friend Jarvis, who organized this whole tour for me. Amazing. Yeah. We sang at a place that's my favorite, one of my favorite places in the world to sing, and that's Harvest House in Moncton. I tell you, um, yeah, come on. Let's get crazy. A bit more guitar, if you don't mind. Art. A little bit more guitar up here, thanks. Art. 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 When a guy's called Art and you're from Australia and you say his name the way you say it, he doesn't turn around. Ah! He thinks someone's clearing their throat. What's... Art. Art. I don't know where you live um, and I don't know what you support, but I told those folks today at Harvest House that I would ask you to see if there's some way that you can support what's going on down there. Um, they're raising money to build a shelter for women that have come out of abusive places. And I'm just going to go out on a limb here, and if it means I don't get invited back, I think I can deal with it, even though I'll be sad. And this is not in reference to this group. But there's so many Christian conferences and worship conferences, and there's so much money spent. When I'm down at Harvest House, I just want to take everything I own and sell it because it just feels so street level. It feels like these are the people that Jesus went to. And we're trying to put him up in lights and put him in showbiz a lot of times. And we're getting these rock star singers and rock star Christian worship leaders and rock star preachers to tell us what we already know. Love God, love others. Care for the sick, care for the poor, care for those that are beaten down. So Harvest House, Harvest House, one thing you can do is you can go get a $20 Timmy's card and take it down there because they're giving it out to women who are on the street, people on the street. So I want to say they've inspired me. Thank you so much for having me. God bless you all. <sighs> Until this week, I thought maybe Jesus was American, but I think he might be Canadian. <laughs> not really, not really, not really. <laughs> God speaking through Australians probably is the end times. That's true.